it has begun guys and people thought we were just talking crazy and people still think this is all just what a conspiracy but is it truly guys we look at this from james the who are planning to develop a global digital v passport for any v right this is unelected technocratic control no one voted for this guys this is just wait wait a minute stop it guys who releases plan for global digital v passports funded by bill gates right oh there we go and then the rockefeller foundation as well interesting these two groups right interesting guys wow hold on a minute guys hold on just a moment this is actually coming out and about the world health organization has released a proposal backed by two major globalist organizations that serves as a blueprint for governments to implement a worldwide fee passport verification system the document called digital documentation of c you guys know v status right whoa funded by them guys i can't believe it we're heading into this new era like we've been talking about and it's actually coming into fruition right this is why we have to prepare before it takes place guys i mean at least we know what's upcoming right a lot of people don't a lot of people think this is all just bs right but is it truly when these people are coming out and stating this right here look at this barcode or qr code guys there we go it, it's crazy because all these things already have happened where in china right obviously with uh, i'm not sure about the v passport but about the qr codes and all this other stuff right it's notable how the only groups actively pushing for global v passports are also the main proponents of the so-called quote-unquote great reset wait what you can't forget that guys right exactly it all ties in guys it's, it all ties in they want these people are all what just puppets right to push the higher ups agendas and narratives towards this new world that we will enter right that we the transition will take place guys and it's happening right now with everything we have been seeing throughout the world guys slowly but surely they want more power they want things to become more centralized right again you guys should probably i don't know at least we are prepared at least we will take advantage of what a the planned crisis that's upcoming right with xrp it all ties in guys listen to this world bank group under the guise of inclusivity and equality every baby born will be issued with a digital id dna and biometric stored for profit by corporates and governments you will trade freedom for convenience they are banking on it exactly there's always a what a equivalent exchange guys right what did we talk about before that the future world will be very comfortable universal basic income right all these other things vr ar right all the robots ai all these other things but what what will humanity sacrifice for all of that guys right at the end of the day what freedom perhaps um privacy right it's a crazy world we're living in because it's happening as we speak from Goldograph, bank of england deputy governor says the uk may need digital pound here it comes wow discussed if the collapse of crypto firm ftx should be should influence the bank's decision to issue a digital pound oh really wow these people are really taking advantage of this ftx situation right aren't they guys they definitely are look at that symbol right there guys <sighs> it's a crazy world we're living in again it's happening as we speak how come people don't see where we're headed towards right or where this world is headed towards guys it's crazy 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 now this is absolutely just crazy 4chan insider it's over there's an insider by the way quote unquote insider maybe i'm not sure rip coinbase wait what contagion issues insider here <laughs> coinbase has quote unquote lost 600,000 bitcoin since it started due to mismanagement and not understanding how to survive a bear market they are scrambling to raise capital and will fail you will see them announce this shortly grayskill has already started damage control via twitter over the weekend you have been warned guys a lot of talks about grayskill as well right that they will go down so i don't know guys i'm not sure coinbase we know the we know coinbase is what backed by the quote-unquote elites right i don't know every other company has to go probably now 
People think the collapse of FTX was bad, just wait until Tether eventually pops. And this is where 99.6 to 99.9%, I'm guessing, have to go away, and it will, guys. Tether makes up 85% of Bitcoin's volume. Exactly. With it's gone, Bitcoin will be trading far below $5,000 again, under 3K, I believe, guys. It's a ticking time bomb, if not lower, right? Don't say you weren't warned. Exactly. 9 billion versus 68 billion, guys, right? We're talking about this is crazy to me guys and most people don't see what's upcoming right this is the finale this will be the finale while every other crypto company and crypto coin goes to s who will still be here in 10 years and longer right look at this from Riz xrp is ripple becoming a bank a lot of people don't know this in 2013 chris larson then ceo of ripple held a meeting uh, where he gave a presentation, and guess who was there in 2013? The SEC, the CFTC, the Fed, the Treasury Department, all of those people, all the regulators of the United States for financial markets. FinCEN was there, okay? Um, they were all present, and he discussed how he envisioned XRP and how it was going to be used to solve, you know, payments issues and cross-border payments, blah, blah, blah. That's 2013, and, and then people need to realize what I pointed out to the judge, which Ripple did as well, that 2015, actually what I pointed out, and because you never know if the judge knows this, but in 2014, one year after that Chris Larson presentation, the Government Accountability Office, okay, the GAO, described XRP itself, by itself, with other, you know, as a, quote, virtual currency utilized in a decentralized payments system okay that's 2014. so then we get the next year and then fincen happens and xrp becomes the first regulated cryptocurrency in the united states so everybody talks about oh, there's no regulation no no xrp was regulated more than bitcoin right because there was they said fincen said this is a convertible virtual currency and told ripple it says, and I've read the documents, I gave it to the judge, uh, Ripple shall, shall is means ex you, you have no choice, shall register all XRP sales through FinCEN and comply with the banking secrecy laws, the BSA, and banking laws, basically, AML, know your customer, all that, not securities laws. And so, wow, guys, I almost forgot about FinCEN as well. So what does that tell us? And plus... The SEC still went after Ripple. That's how you know this is a grand show, right? Which we cannot make up. Nothing makes sense, guys. Nothing does, right? A lot of people thought FTX was was good to go. FTX was had had these other people showing for them, right? Which we know, and look and look where, where FTX went. Now, to be clear, the SEC hasn't labeled XRP a security, nor does it have the power to do so. One judge put it this way. The SEC can only ask the question and the courts will and the courts ultimately answers, right? Exactly. You know what's crazy about this right here? Look at this guys. Everyone is what? H going after Gary Gensler at this point in time, right? SEC chair Gary Gensler faces a growing political problem. He has a shrinking number of allies in Washington, right? So it's getting really bad for them guys over there. And it's his time to go right soon i mean look look at the corruption that's taking place at the end of the day there's so much you guys know sam bankman fried and gang were meeting with jerome powell as well right as they were getting ready to crank the rates you can't make this stuff up hold on a minute we got he met gary genster he met cftc one of the cft one of the cftc people he met powell and i believe treasury as well whoa guys this is crazy right so much guys and people still thought they were good to go remember nothing is too big to fail right you can't make this stuff up gary gensler has to go as well guys scoop sources sec says gary gensler's new market structure plan could be unveiled at a december 14 open meeting wait isn't the fomc meeting at that time as well hmm hold on a minute guys let's see what takes place right this is fascinating stuff but Will it get much worse before it gets better? I believe so, guys. Look at how many coins, right? Not even, this is nothing, guys. Go on CoinMarketCap or one of these other metrics that shows how many coins there are. 
in the cryptosphere. Over 20,000, I'm guessing, I think. 99.9% .9 have to go away, guys. Sigh. Look at this right here. Charts suggest the S&P 500 will rally in December. Jim Cramer says, exactly, there we go. We'll probably head lower, right? The reason why, I mean, stocks basically have bottomed out, right? Stocks have been rallying so crazy. And, and I'm pretty sure they're going to price protect the guys, the stocks from falling and creating a new low. That's why they have been pumping. Bitcoin dumped and created a new low. XRP is holding strong, which is very fascinating stuff, right? Bitfinex is sued out memories. FTX is running a Ponzi with their tether buddies, right? This was all the way from a year ago, guys. These people were warning us, right? We're warning everyone of what's upcoming. FTX, again, tether is next, guys. Or the finale, shall we say. Last but not least from X Anderson, nothing is more important right now than, quote, don't listen to what they say, watch what they do, end quote, right? Exactly, guys. Always what the opposite takes place. Remember, 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 guys. Don't be fooled. Do not fall into, into the traps that are laid below, right? Not financial advice. But anyways, that's all for you guys. Enjoy today's video. If you guys are pleased with us, see you.